the Army today. Forensics on the battlefield. Gail McCabe shows us just how lab work could neutralize improvised explosive devices. The art and science of forensics is real. And like its TV counterparts, it is spoken, processed, scanned, and most importantly, it is applied. Is it CSI Miami? No, it is not. However, it is the science of forensics that allows us to capture the bad guy. The bad guys are perpetrators of IEDs, improvised explosive devices. The theater is Afghanistan, and this most restrictive of labs is known as SEXI. SEXI is the Combined Explosive Exploitation Cell. The team is a mixture of military and contractor. Together, they are building a database of latent prints, a scientific tool critical to the fight. We actually utilize the known impression that is collected in the field. We take that known impression and we collect collectively compare it to the latent print that was developed on, could be a bomb, could be tape, could be anything. Sure. Sexy Not operates 24-7, scrutinizing the tattered remnants of bomb blasts, comparing, analyzing, and digitally capturing thousands of impressions, on average pushing out well over 100 cases a week. These crisp, clear lines are indicators or unique characteristics that allow us to identify another individual to another. Here we have cyanoacrylate. According to 37-year-old Kelly, Getting these bad guys these is the defining difference between sex and TV. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television. For more on this and other stories, go to the Army's homepage at Army.mil.